Email from Sasha Gray. I received uh, her original email from uh, April 10th, uh, 2006. Hi, my name is. Uh, here's new, some new photos, personal info. Enjoy. I hope to hear back soon. She didn't include her stage name because she didn't have one yet. Open to discuss it. Then she wrote, and she'd never worked before, available for solo, stills, girl, 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 anal, boy, girl, boy, boy, girl, ATM, anal, DP, double vag, interracial, throat gagging, swallowing, cream pie, BDSM, fetish, facials, feature dancing, bachelor parties, and groups of no more than four. Well, she worked with six people the first time she worked. Well, Sasha's a little different, in my opinion. She wasn't you know, the typical bouncy porno girl who was just kind of there. She, what really struck me about her was the letter that she wrote to the agent, Mark Spiegler, about why she wanted to be in porn. I'm in the adult film scene for mainly one reason. On average, most of the porn I see is boring and does not arouse me physically or visually. There's only a handful of porn stars that continue to push the boundaries of what women are supposed to be like or be like in bed. This entices me to be one of these young women, not to mention my lust for sexual creativity, I hunger for all modes of sexual perversity. I'm determined and ready to be a commodity that fulfills everyone's fantasies. After hearing that, I was like, this type of person is the girl who needs to be important. Together, and I like, I really look up to her, and she's only 18, you know? I want to show people that I love what I do, you know? This isn't a nine to five job, and I go home and beat my kids and hate my husband, you know? I like what I do. I don't have a, I don't consider my job boring at all. <laughs> and, um, yeah, it's definitely something I'm proud of. I, I feel really strongly about, about what I do, and a lot of people don't take it that seriously, and they just think it's, you know, a buck for a fuck, and that's not what it is. You make your name a trademark. You know, that's what I believe. You, you coin your name, and you coin your image, and people want to keep seeing you, but eventually there's going to be a time where you get burned out and you're gonna be so tired and so stressed out that you're not gonna be able to work. They squeeze you up like a piece of fruit, drain all the juice out of you, and then they're done. My parents got divorced when I was five. I grew up in a poor area with my mom, my brother, and sister. The best way I put my mom is she's a survivor. You know, she raised three kids on her own. And you have to have a lot of balls to do that. No, my mom did not know that I was getting ready to do porn because I think she would have done everything in her power to not let me leave, you know. We're gonna stay like this for the rest of our lives. We're out of sight. We're out of sight. I started acting when I was 12. I wouldn't say professionally, but I mean, you know, taking real theater classes. I'm not looking to get into the next blockbuster, you know, the next Spider-Man. It's not about that for me. And the darkness invades me. Oh, my black light, it shines at midnight. And the darkness invades me. They found out today I don't do what they say, yeah And the hearts, they all start to break